The sponge cake should be ready to come from the oven now. So we just take it out. Perfect. Okay. Now, you know the sponge cake is baked when it has shrunk back slightly from the edge of the tin, as you see there. But more importantly, when you press on the sponge cake, it springs back up. There we know the sponge cake is baked. And this applies to a Victoria Madeira mixture, the same as to an egg sponge as we have here. But the next important point is, having checked that the cake is baked, you must quickly turn it immediately out of the tin onto a wire tray. And then as quickly as possible after that, remove the lining paper. Because the light sponge cake will start to shrink in that the heat in the form of steam will go back into your very light sponge causing it to shrink if you leave it in the tin for any length of time or indeed even in the lining paper. So you start by, as I've done there, peel the paper from the four sides and then just gingerly, gently do the top or the bottom. So there we have our sponge cake now beautifully baked and on the wire tray to cool. So we just leave it there now and we can convert that into a layer cake in a little while.